I grew up in a very sheltered community. It was great. A lot of camping, gardening, farm life, grew all our own food. Because my family moved overseas when I was about to be starting my senior year of high school, I went with them and as a result did not finish high school. I was actually working instead, but I've always loved learning. So that motivated me to go back to the States and get my GED. Community college is where I discovered I wanted to do business, and compared to the other schools I got into, like Whitman was just definitely a cut above. They put a lot of the community college transfers in the same class, which was nice because sometimes it can be a little awkward to be the kid from the community college. I really would like to have a job doing something that I love after I graduate, and Whitman, it's an exceptional school. Syracuse Women's Rugby. They welcome everybody who is dedicated to working to be part of the team. I jumped at the opportunity. We're trying to be a club and then also like be members of the community. We're going to be participating in Take Back the Night. So it, it's a great balance of like meeting girls who want to like be involved in a club sport and also help out the community at the same time. I've always found it very relaxing to paint and just get in touch with like a slightly more calm side of myself. I really like to paint buildings. I like the shapes. I have a couple paintings that I did from when I lived in England, and I really like those. They sort of remind me of home. And I'm currently trying to do a series of Syracuse paintings. About five years ago, I would have never even dreamed that I would be at a real university that people, I mean, you say you go to Syracuse, people know what you're talking about. It feels like a really big accomplishment just to be here and every day. I mean, it might sound cliche, but I wake up and I'm like, I go to a proper school. I have a shot. The playing field is leveled.